great division. This is me, your friend, Amechi Oke, one of the many voices talking about this great opportunity that all of us have come to love. I just want to briefly show my face. I will not be showing it steady because I am yet to dress up and get ready for today's activity. But uh, after the meeting today with the, with the admin, it's all about excitement. You know, wrongly, many people get it wrong, thinking that TBC admin is, an, is, is autocratic in nature, that it doesn't listen. And people go about saying all things of their lives. But may I humbly let such ones know that we have come a long way in TBC community and it is the right time we stand up and do the needful. So folks, I'll be sharing with you some important updates that we have achieved, you know, from today's meeting. We are going places. People should understand that TBC is not what is obtainable out there. What you have out there is nothing but click here to withdraw, which has been where people are getting drunk altogether. I want to let people know that with TBC, we are busy building spendable currency and not exchangeable currencies. What do I say? We are building spendable currencies and not exchangeable currencies, whereby you see many coins out there. Hey, or how, how much, what is it on the market? On this exchange platform, on that exchange platform. But no, that is not the issue with TBC. With TBC, we are rather building merchant base that you can confidently go to and have your TBC spend for goods and services. We are bringing in people of all, merchants of all type into TBC community and that is where our currency, that is where our coins has value, okay? It's not all about you have the currency or you have money, you have to change it to one form or the other before you'll be able to use it, no. We are looking at coins, we are looking at market acceptable money, not what we have out there, okay? Some people have money, but they'll be hungry because no way to exchange it. TBC, we are working directly with merchants and that is the thing we are building now. That is the major thing, that is the most important thing. So the good news we received today actually made everybody extremely happy, okay? Because when people are told that, Things are changing for the better in TBC community. Some are not yet understanding it. But how I wish that people understand it just the way it is. So we are looking for merchants. And this merchant, let not that name, merchant, be an obstacle. Merchant could be that next door neighbor selling something at the frontage. That's your your customer selling something at the market. It could be cement shop, it could be a provision store, it can be anything, it can be whatsoever go to tbc the gringo cash uh, gringo .cash, you see the merchant listing of those who are coming into tbc okay those who are having their goods and services displayed on tbc platform and tbc is giving it to them free of charge and not only that when somebody registers and pay admin fee admin has told us that such ones will be giving upwards 100 TBC coin. Isn't that wonderful, folks? Man, we have everything. It's only that many people don't know the value of what they have. So let's go out there. Because each merchant that you bring into TBC is equivalent to one full TBC. When you bring a merchant registered in TBC community, you'll be given one full TBC for doing that. And if all the people that you register in the TBC that have become merchants, counting from 2017 till date, they'll be counted for you, and that means additional TBC for you. But people are getting it wrong, thinking that TBC is useless. Works. you don't know what you're missing. 
you don't know what you're missing. Okay? Let people open their eyes and see other opportunities they have building TBC community. When you go out, bring in merchants. And when those merchants, when they pay their admin fee, 50% comes to you, okay? Not only that, as you are doing your best, bringing in merchants in TBC and helping to build TBC, you also have that cake. I say it's cake, that rotator. That rotator is very sweet. That's why whenever I'm talking, I'm always helping people to understand that with TBC, you have every source of income for covered. Uh, let me do TBC and I'm doing this and I'm doing that. If for those who have given at least, let me say they're 80% to TBC, not those who have given 100%. I'm just saying about 80% of their time to TBC. You see that? They are not complaining. Because are you looking for spendable cash? At least money you can easily make use of practically, you know. It's in TBC. You have it in Bitcoin bounty, you have it in a Bitcoin contest, you have it in heavy heater, you have it in rotator. Now tell me, you have it when you, man, we have everything in TBC. But people are not seeing things, and I don't know the reason why they are not seeing it that way. Folks, I want you to open your eyes and see where we are headed in TBC community. I want you to understand that what we have in TBC is nowhere to be found elsewhere. It's no other way. You cannot get what we have in TBC elsewhere. And that is why we go about calling on people, come and join us in TBC community. And as for today, when you register in TBC, keep making sure that you have people registered Okay, you have people registered using this very link. I continue to emphasize on this because I know the importance. Make people know the importance of registering as TBC merchants, merchants in TBC. Okay? So this is the link you use to register those people dealing on merchandise of all sorts. It could be a restaurant who serve as long as you can exchange money, money exchanges and register them. It doesn't mean that they have to be a certain TBC, no. And after registering them normally, you just come down here under account. When you come under account, I keep on teaching this, helping people to know that it is very easy to do. When you come under the account, you count accounts, pay book payments, approve residual credits, payment history, change sponsor from admin case. If you're, you register somebody and you're not seeing the person, just come down here, click on this very link, Okay, when you click here, you're going to see that that person is still under admin. But now, look at my, my own says your sponsor is not admin. Your referral sponsor has been set and your new sponsor has received referral Bitcoin bounty for your account. You may not make further changes. For now, you're not making any further changes. But if your, your, your referral fall into admin, you will have opportunity for changing that. Is that not wonderful? And some people say that they don't know what admin is. Admin is doing a whole lot. It's just that those who are greed, greediness doesn't allow people to see clearly. So where I was actually going before I quickly drive that the, is this very area, merchant listing. This is the main area for focus. Okay? 250 million to be distributed. I'm still going to read that for you because I will still play um, and the Derek's audio in addition to this. So when you come down here, click on this merchant listing. When you go there, you will have opportunity, okay? You have opportunity to register merchant. Click here, click, click here and fill the form and follow through exactly what you have in there. So all these things are very simple. But the reason why we keep on emphasizing here is that people should know what we mean. Just people should know where we are focused because our main focus now is bring in merchants. Each merchant you bring into the community of TBC today is equal to one TB, one full TBC coin will be given to you. Admin is being so generous and people should open their eyes and get things straightened out. Those who have a lot of TBC coin and uh, they are looking at it as nothing, making fun of 
those who are working hard in TBC, I'm sorry for them because the thing that you have but for what you have may not actually benefit you if you don't start doing the right thing. If you don't start doing things that give value to what you have, I'm sorry for you. So folks, we are into something of real value and which we will not keep quiet, which we will not allow people to use less. So if you want, if you are members of the mass adoption, in TBC, those who are at the top of the whole thing. This is where we come. Because days are gone whereby we throw our meeting open to everybody. If your KCBO is not active, folks, forget about it. If you are not in team A, forget about it. You will not be having that, uh, taking part in that mass adoption training. So we are going places, we are going here big. We are getting things strengthened out in TBC and the admin listings admin is very open to what people want to say but those who are still not getting it i'm sorry for them so folks i want you to open your eyes and understand that when it comes to the real thing we have it we have it the exponential growth that we are going to be having in tbc wow 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 so let me go to my WhatsApp and just show you the update that is making waves now. The update that people are indeed, you know, happy. The update that is keeping everybody, you know, trying to do the right thing. So I will play this audio from the Derek and you listen and listen very well and see that we have something of value in the community. Please listen to what Embe Derrick has to say here and try to pick point from what he is saying. I believe strongly that you're going to love it. Good morning. We just finished another exciting meeting with the TBC admin some few minutes ago. And during this meeting, we have gathered or I personally have gathered and can clearly confirm that every success story is a tale of constant adoption. Every success story is a tale of constant adoption. Did you hear that very well? Every success story is a tale of constant adoption. Changes that will make things work out for better. Please continue to pay attention to this. Revision and change. So the members of the mass adoption team have voted for revision. They have voted for change. They have voted for a better growth as far as TBC is concerned. As a result of that, the admin of TBC has come up with what we are going to call the TBC uh, Summer Billionaire Promo. The TBC Summer Billionaire Promo is going to be so, so exciting because the members of the mass adoption team have voted for a change. They have voted for a revision. So all the restrictions that were placed in order for you to remain in team A have been uplifted, meaning that there shall not be any restriction anymore. As a matter of fact, it doesn't matter anymore whether there is A team or B team. So what I believe strongly that you listen to that. I know that we have something of great value in TBC community. And that thing that we have in TBC community is getting bigger and bigger and bigger because uh, all serious members in the community 
they have good reasons why they are dancing, okay? They have good reasons why everything they are doing has value. So what are we saying or what are we doing? Why are we still behaving as if we don't know what we are doing? Some of us are behaving as if they don't know what they are doing. But folks, may I tell you that you better wake up. When you wake up, great thing awaits you in TBC community. Stop being a drama queen. Stop allowing what you don't know to confuse you. Try to be in the know. Let's continue to listen to what Emedelic has to say. Exhibitions have been uplifted, meaning that there shall not be any restriction anymore. As a matter of fact, it doesn't matter anymore whether there is 18 or beating. So, what matters now? We need growth. We need to revise. We need change. We need to empty the admin's wallet, which is the most important thing right now. Emptying the admin's wallet is the most important. But the question I want to ask is that before the admin's wallet is empty, what portion, what quantity of TBC are you going to have? Are you just going to have some 50 TBC, 30 TBC? Or are you going to have millions of TBC? Or 50 of 50,000 uh, 50, TBC? That is the question. What matters now is to empty the admin's wallet. So admin is placing about 250 million coins to be distributed so far so that we can get rid of his wallets. So the TBC Summer Billionaire promo will permit anybody that pay his admin fee to have 100 TBC coins. Listen, henceforth, any person that pays his admin fee will have 100 TBC coins as from July 2020. And it's going to be retroactive for those in June who have already paid their admin fee. It's going to be retroactive for those who have already paid their admin fee. So let me quickly show you what that means. You see here, in June, I paid my admin fee and I got 30 TBC. So what it means here is that this 30, 70 more will be credited to my account. And henceforth, each time I pay admin fee, instead of getting 30 TBC, I'm getting 100 full coin. And if I am to bring in any merchant, I'm going to get one full TBC. For instance, now, if I have maybe under my care now about five merchants, or I have 20 merchants, or I have 100 merchants, what it means is that in addition to the 70 here that will still be given to me, I will have additional 30, 5, 10, or 100 if I have gotten 100 merchants. So, folks. Let's continue to listen to what Mr. Derek is telling us here. Because it's all about excitement. So the software programmers are actually building the software that will permit all those that have paid the admin fee for the month of June to have 100 coins. And those coming in in the month of July, henceforth, will also have 100 TBC coins. All right, so for those, it doesn't matter whether you're in team A now or not. What matters now is for you to position yourself to earn the rotator fundings that the admin is going to put in place for the 111,111 members. So in order to fasten growth, the mass adoption members have voted that all the restrictions to bring in two members should be removed. 
and admin has agreed with those of us in the mass adoption team. So if you are not in the mass adoption team, we therefore invite you to be active by paying your admin fee and join the mass adoption team training taking place every Monday to Friday when it is 8 a.m. West African time. It is going to be awesome because we welcome everybody who is active in the community. We are going to expand our room to a thousand members because right now we are already exceeding 300 members every day. So we shall actually expand the room to a thousand members. So all restrictions for you to stay in team A has actually been removed. What matters now is for you to pay your admin fee, got 100 coins, and also have, if you bring in one merchant, you are also going to have one extra coins. Okay, now let's quickly address this. If you bring in one merchant, you have one extra coin. And now, if that merchant who is your referral pays the admin fee, which you as a member of TBC is also paying, look at this. Look at this. As an example, let's assume now that this very person, okay, from Ivory Coast, is having six referrals. What it means that 50% of the admin fee, because these people now, you show, they are showing here because they have paid their admin fee. Now, let me go and read it that way you understand it. Okay, this may not be explaining the situation there. But notwithstanding, the issue here says that uh, the okay, less than four days for the new contest. So this very contest is another way whereby Tibetans are making money. Once your referrals are busy making sure that they renew their account, each time they renew their account, you are entitled to 50% of that. So, and for this person now, if these six members are merchants in TBC. What it means is that he will be getting six full TBC because he has merchants under him. Aside from that, he'll be getting 50% each of their admin fee. And if at the end of the week, he becomes the number one here, he'll be going home with additional $700 or even more. This person will be going home with additional $350. This person will be going in with additional $150. Now tell me, why do people try to compare TBC to MLM? Why do people try to compare TBC to the funny, funny things that are being out there? But we need to listen up and get our understanding very clear. Let's continue to hear in there. All right. So you bring in one merchant, you have one extra coin that can be 111. A uh, one run, a one coins in a month if you bring in one merchant. Now, what will happen in order for you to remain and benefit the rotator fundings? All the one hundred and eleven thousand one hundred, all the one hundred eleven thousand members should be able, okay, should be able to uh, bring in merchants. All right, and we shall now classify them depending on the number of merchants that they have actually brought in, starting from the highest number of merchants. So for you to stay in the spot, for you to maintain that spot to benefit the rotator fundings, you should be able to bring in at least one merchant in the community. And it doesn't matter if the merchant, it doesn't matter if the merchant is accepting CBC or not. It doesn't matter if the merchant submit his document or not, what matters? It doesn't matter if the merchant is accepting, accepting TBC or not. It doesn't matter if the merchant submits his or her document or not. One good thing here is that TBC is for all. TBC is for the whole world. There is no hindrance. Let people learn to Remove those hindrances they are placing on themselves. Look at 
they are being called. Please come and have your business advertised on our platform. Don't worry. Even if you are not accepting TBC, the time is going to come whereby you'll be the one rushing to accept TBC. Okay? And if the merchants go ahead and even renew their account in TBC, they'll be giving 100 TBC coin. Just tell me what we are not getting right here. Just tell me why some people can't get it right. Embe, you have ideas. Is that he should come to our community. And even if, okay, and uh, even if the merchants, or you register the merchants since 2017 or 2016, it will, it will also count. So when we reach a certain number, we shall now be able to classify those bringing in highest number of merchants to benefit the rotator funding. The rotator funding is actually money that admin is sharing or uh, part of the admin fee that is going to be distributed to all the members that shall be active and bringing in merchants. And you can have the rotator icon already in your back office right now and members are actually being paid who are active. So all... You want to see that rotator icon? Let me show you because when we are saying or when we are doing anything in TBC community, you don't just go pointing at what we are not seeing. We are practical to the core, okay? Now, you wanna know how the rotator icon looks like? Let me just give you a quick view of that, okay? What I see here, look at the rotator where the money is dropping steadily, okay? Look at what you have. Hmm? You have zero point chemical chemical BTC, not TBC, Bitcoin in mass adoption of total funding. Folks, if I just want to withdraw here, I just need to click. I just need to touch your palm. Once I check here now and go over and say withdraw, you see everything taken, but it is still hanging here. So what are we saying? We are not missing what when we say that we have it and we have the best in TBC community. Okay? We continue to hear what MB is telling us. Mr. Derek, go ahead, please. Those that want to remain in the mass adoption or in those that want to remain and benefit the rotator fundings, make sure that you are active and you have a couple of months to bring in at least one nation. I'm going to bring in a hundred. I don't know about you. So all restrictions have been removed to bring in one person or two persons is not obligatory. But if you bring it more people, you're going to benefit Bitcoin bounties. If you bring in nature, you will remain in the rotator program. You're gonna re remain in the rotator program, okay? So guys, use this to your greatest advantage and let's bring in nature and start the economic phase of CBC. Admin has personally told me that our nation platform is going to be developed and make it more user friendly and beautiful. So do not worry the way you see the nation platform right now is going to be very and maintain your position to benefit the rotator fundings. Just remember, remember for you to benefit the rotator fundings to uh, eternity, you need to have the highest number of nature because the 111,111 members that will remain will be classified according to the number of merchants that they are going to bring into the community. So bring in more merchants, maintain your position, and have the rotator funding in Bitcoin that is being paid in cash. And remember that each person that you bring in who pays the admin fee, you as the sponsor will have 12 dollar in Bitcoin that you can actually cash it out. If you bring in more people to benefit this powerful promotion, you have more. Our TBC uh, 009 wallet is under maintenance and uh, give it a couple of days, I'm sure from now to weekend, all right? Everything should be up, the QR code, everything should be up. You can scan and do payment. We are going to have 
lots and lots of uh, uh, other currencies in our uh, in our wallets, and of course, other cryptocurrencies will be there. Guys, it doesn't matter now the value of CBC in dollars. What matters for me right now is for us to enter the access wallet. I mean, it's so anxious to see that the wallet is empty so that we can do more better things. So we need to empty the admin's wallet as it stands right now. Okay? We are abundant days. And admin, uh, there were members uh, uh, complained about um, getting uh, members having a lot of TBC and they are not active. Yes. That is a call for concern and I support the leaders that um, want us to deal with those with highest coins and they are not active, we are going to deal with that once everybody is happy. So we're going to provide, we're going to make sure everybody's happy, you receive the coins, and then uh, benefit the rotator, benefit the merchants, benefit the bounties, and then those that are, will be inactive with a lot of coins, we are going to deal with them. We are going to sit down as a math adoption team members and decide. Remember, it's not more the admin that is deciding alone. It is now the mass adoption team members deciding right now. And we have voted. We have voted for a revision. We have voted for a change. Do you hear that? It is no longer one person deciding. The whole committee now is having a lot of people as admins. So get that straightened out. In case if you are still living in the, in the olden days, please stand up and understand what is happening before the motto leaves you behind. Embe, we are with you. And that change is what we have been looking for. So let's go out there and empty the admin's wallets, get excited because there's a whole lot for us to gain. Okay, so guys, this is Babe Beric, and I'm going to end here for today. And I keep saying, every success story is a tale of constant adoption, revision, and change. Good morning. Thank you, Mr. Mbederi, for your time. We have heard it, and we have seen it, and we are always excited. Our excitement is not just a blind excitement. Our excitement in the community is always with reason. Our excitement in the community goes with proper understanding of what we know, okay? Can we just shake our body a little? Thank you so much for listening. This is no other person than that your friend in TBC, than that person that most of you runs to in terms of some technical issues, but which admin has placed on the hands of others to be taking care of you. But that doesn't stop you, especially those who are making use of my services in various ways, helping them to actually know how to do some certain things in the community. I will say that I am very, very glad, okay, having you. When I say that I'm very glad having you is, I'm not missing what saying that because there are reasons behind what we are doing. There are reasons for doing that because uh, we have enough. The people who usually come to me that they want to have some certain issue thrashed out. I don't think anyone has ever come to me and complained because I've learned to do the best I can in the community. I've learned to be of help to people in the community. I've learned to continue to support them to do the best they can to get us going in the right direction. Why do I have to say this? If you go to TBC 
the, the, I mean, the clinical cash, clinical dot cash area. Let me just quickly go in there. And while doing that, I would like to share my screen, okay? To help you see what I mean. I like to share my screen because in TBC, we have a whole lot in common, okay? Just quickly take a look at it before I end this session, okay? Hope my screen is live. So you come to merchant location, merchant location, you click here. When you click there, you now search country. I have to select Nigeria because I am in Nigeria, Nigerian, okay? Then you come here, select states. Which states am I? You can actually come and then look for a boy state. On that at a boy state, for you to know that I actually feel as a merchant in this community, okay? Check up for me, Nabakliki. When you come here, what do you see? You scroll, okay? This is somebody, is it to a uh, cryptocurrency exchange and gist? You know, he sell this with Bitcoin and the rest of it. You can contact him. He's very good in that. You have his address that you can equally go through the merchant list locations through Abakaliki Point State. You see 50 Hazard Road, Abakaliki Point State. And then you have someone also here. He's into uh, Beauty Hair Salon. Then you come down here, you see me. And you're going to see me with a thumbs up from admin. Say, be part, be a part of TBC history. My name here, TBC trainer and Pringle Cash Educationist. It is the, the name, Pringle Cash Education, because there's nothing that has to do with Pringle Cash that you find for me and you will not get it. So we have many things we love in TBC. So if I tell you that most of these people even have here, they're not even a certain TBC, but TBC is busy promoting their businesses. This is one guy, he's into civil engineering. He has said TBC 30%, okay? So forget about this uh, a banner here. It doesn't correspond, it will soon be removed. I don't know who put it there or something like that. But look at the name, as the person it can do, civil engineering, building construction and printing. So anything you want here, contact him, see his phone number. See his phone number here. Nice, in a point, I'm clicking. So we have other ones which, and again, another thing I want people to quickly understand is this. Some who are into multi-level marketing, they mistakenly think that we are, <laughs> we are competing with them. Folks, we are not competing with anybody. We are not competing with anyone. We are separately on our own. Look at this. Look at this. In Lagos. Can you come to Lagos? Search here. Search. Okay, Lakey, for instance, see what will surprise you. We are just good, TBC, Tibetan, we are just good. We are giving people, look at this. This is a multi-level marketing uh, uh, people. They are into health products. Okay, these people, they are MLMs. So come here and advertise your goods freely. Don't say that before I join you, you need to join my networking. No, we're not, not, we not into networking. Look, look at the number. And they are dealing on this very fantastic health product known as STC that You see many of them, okay? Super life, okay? So we are doing what people are paying millions of naira to have done for them. But we are advertising for free, people free. Look at the benefit that people are gaining just by being in TBC community. Look at, okay? Okay, we come to here. This is another one, Rain, Rain Core, which is a very nice product. Where do you have all these things? You have it where you come to TBC platform, you go to Merchant Location, you can search and see what you need. So folks, we don't see reason why people should be getting us you know, wrongly because we are not competing with anybody. We don't compete, rather we support. We support people to make good out of whatever things they are doing, which is acceptable and legal. So folks, we are lawful to the core. We are very, very lawful. 
And when you go about thinking, oh, what sort of people can I include? Who, who, what type? When it comes to merchants, let me also show you something here. Let me show you something again here. Let's say in the state. Let me also quickly show you what you have in the merchant location that will surprise you. Look at what I have in here. In the boy state, you have someone into a digital photo. You have his uh, contact. Okay, this is being advertised for free. And when these people see the need of paying for the admin fee for them to have something like this, are they not happy? Admin actually showed a thumb up on this. Okay, see this one. It's, it's a doctor, he's into a medical dispenser. Look at how small his shop is, but he fixed it in TBC community and then admin support. Look at this one, is into uh, aluminium. They make slide window. Look at Amaco windows, cascade of all type, projected sliding, reverse ETC. Their contact is also there. Then this one is a dry cleaner. His contact is also there. So just tell me who else? Look at this man. Yeah. I registered him. I do patronize him. So he saw the need of coming into TBC and having his business you know, put in place. Where do I start from? We just have the ball. So what is hindering you? Go out there and get people registered. Let's get our merchant uh, 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 location filled up. Let people know that whoever, whatever you are looking for, any type of services, you can get it on TBC platform. These people don't have to be accepting TBC, but they are here benefiting from all the TBC has to offer. Huh? And when you say that, when you look at the goodwill aspect, you know, when you come here, you just have to be, be happy. I mean, you just have to be happy. Happy for what TBC is doing for humanity. TBC is helping out to the best it can. TBC has goodwill ambassadors. A few months ago, in March, besides, we had these two people sitting coffee and bed Eric and his wife. They were here. Go there and read up the story. See the type of people that TBC reached out to. Look at, look at. See in the Derrick here in Ebony State. Even see, okay, see Mr. Solo and other ones. Just imagine. Look at the people that TBC reached out to. When we say that we are here to get people going, feeding the poor, helping you to project your business, helping. We are happy to be shares, folks. I don't know where to start from and where to stop because we are just too much of what we are doing. We are just too much. Okay? See, these are the things that TV Shell, the TBC gave out for free. Most of these people don't even know how to, don't even own for not to talk of, they are not registered in TBC. Let's just quickly hear about this. Just play this video. TBC. Yeah. 
So folks, when you look at this, when you look at this, what comes to your mind? And people still, some people still have the guts to say that TBC is a scam. A scam that goes about feeding poor people. A scam, a scam that goes about calling people to place their business for free on their platform, promoting them. A scam that makes people happy. I wonder what else we can say about TBC. Because we have just the best. We are not competing with anybody. We don't compete with you. I'm calling on you. Come and place your businesses on TBC platform for free. Okay? I said for free. We have it and we have it all. So let's learn to appreciate what we have and give the resounding call to people for them to know that we have it. Look at Folks, don't you like what you're seeing? We are nothing. People say we are nothing. We are useless. People say we are useless. But look at what we are doing. Doesn't that move you as a person? At least to know that we are in for real. This is not only in Nigeria. This wasn't only done here in Nigeria. Other areas benefited. Okay? Are we not happy? Doesn't this make you to feel happy? Look at it. During our ambassador, ambassador's arrival to Imo State, when they were taken to Indigo along with Dr. Solo. Okay? So, folks, why are you not happy being a division? We should be happy. Because so many interesting things are taking place. And many more still coming. Okay, all the solutions are Guys, uh, we are calling on you guys to come to the conference, okay? Because we have lots of things that we want to give to you. Give you schools, schools, so many things so many things I still remember this journey. Had me. May God bless you. The sprinkle. May you live long. May God keep on sustaining you, imparting you with grace, more wisdom, everything in abundance. Okay? Everything in abundance. Here is in Kanu, Nigeria. 
uh, divisions make people happy. Can you imagine? It's good stop distribution, full stop throughout the Berkeley State. See our ambassador having it raw, making it, oh. Telling you, do you want to become a leader or a follower? Um, I consider this training leadership training because I want to duplicate myself. Become a leader that creates more leaders. A sign of a good leader is not how many followers you have, but how many leaders you create. That's the first thing you should know. As a leader, yes. and I'm waiting for those that will show their leadership skills. That will be shanks. Because you have billions, you have billions of people that are suffering. They are very, very poor. When we think only about ourselves, we don't care. And that's why we feel that the number of TBC we are having is much. Because we think only about ourselves. And we thinking about the billions of people that are out there and they are poor. Are we thinking about them? Imagine if you have to build houses to house those people. Children, mother. In Africa, we don't even have uh, buildings just to take care of old people. Do you know what I mean? You can't. It's not going to be enough. So, yeah. so, so guys, what are we saying? Do we have anybody or a let me say a group or whatsoever that can confidently come to compete with TBC? We are helping people out, so why not join us? This is not an issue of is my best right. TBC is my best right. TBC is my best Man, this is a memory that we cannot forget in a hurry. TBC admin did wonderful thing in Nigeria, and it's not something we can easily forget. We can't. We can't. Folks, we can still be coffee all the way from America, doing the same thing. Because CTBC, look at the living standard of people in Lagos. It's pathetic. Okay? So, looking at all these things, I feel like, wow, what is hindering people from joining TBC? What is delaying them? Why wouldn't they look at the writing and jump in, okay? So we have, we are, we are really indebted, highly indebted. 
to TBC admin because so many things that has taken place because of TBC. Many interesting things. So let us go and help people appreciate, help people understand the, the good thing that is happening in the TBS community. Help people know that we are not in any way competing or in any way quarreling with anybody. We are rather here to help people grow. Okay? We help people grow. We help them to say no to lack. So we have so many things that we really keep us going in the TBC community. So folks, we are happy. And our happiness knows no bound. I will continue to say, Chris Kringle, the Varro TBC admin, may God bless you. May God continue to uplift you because you have uplifted so many people around the world. So folks, I'll be calling it a day for this recording because uh, I only took time to just say how I feel. This is Amechi. Please subscribe to my channel and remember to share. I help the people all over the world to see that TBC has come to stay, that TBC is not competing with anybody. We are private and in that privacy, we are busy doing something wonderful, as you can see. So thank you and may you remain blessed. Bye for now.